Hey, it's Morgan, and today we've teamed up with Y-Refi, and we're going on campus today to talk to students about the student debt crisis. What is your major? Chemical engineering. I'm studying marketing. Project management. Okay. Organizational leadership and project management. Biochemistry. Okay. Biochemistry. Biochemistry. <laughs> we got some smart girls over here. Do you have any student loan debt? I do. A lot. A lot. How much debt do you think you'll have by the time you graduate? Um, a couple hundred thousand. <laughs> A couple hundred thousand? Yeah. After four years, probably about a hundred thousand. Over a hundred, easily. We pay. We both pay out-of-state tuition. Two, two hundred, two, two fifty. One hundred and fifty thousand yeah. dollars. How are you avoiding debt right now? My mom. <laughs> Probably 60 or 80,000. Oh my god, I don't even know. I have no idea and I don't want to know. 10K. Okay, that's not bad. Yeah. Not 30K, bad. I'm out of state. It's probably over 100 grand. Over 100,000. Oh yeah. Oh, that hurts. <laughs> like 100K probably. $100,000 yeah. in debt. When do you need to start paying off your debt? Do you know, like right when you graduate, are you gonna wait a little bit before you graduate? Right when I graduate? Yeah, same. Probably when I get like my first like career oriented job. Yeah. Do you know how long it's going to take you to pay off your loan? I have no clue, but uh, I wish the best for myself. And yeah. when I start life, it's going to be probably horrible. Probably going to be like, why am I going to job nine to five? To pay it's going to be, yes, it's going to be a cycle. So probably a decade. That's how long it took my dad, so. Probably right when I get out, I'll start paying, but like my parents have already started paying, so. Maybe a couple decades? Probably. I don't know, years and years. My dad doing that, I don't know. Four or five years. Major budget. That is, yeah, for sure. That's eating rice and chicken uh, and only paying. My mom's house, everything, yep. yep. I might be in the 30s, 40s, just because okay. I don't know what job I want to do yet. Um, I'm targeting less than five years. Less than five years. How are you going to do that? Work. Three years, because I plan to like live at home but I also plan to get my PhD, so we'll see how that goes. Okay, so PhD, more debt? Yeah, more debt. Do you possibly know what your interest rate is? Um, I don't know. I just, you know it's no a variable clue. fixed rate? Yeah, I don't know. No. No clue. I do not. I have no idea. No idea. Grotto. No clue. I have no, no clue. clue. <laughs> no, no clue. I definitely need to like figure that out, but <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> not a clue. No. Do you know if it's a fixed or a variable rate? No. <laughs> Nope. nope, no idea. <laughs> Do you know if you have a fixed or a variable rate? Nope, I don't even know what that means. What are your thoughts on the student loan debt crisis? There's just no way you could pay off like hundreds of thousands of dollars yeah. in debt. I don't think people take it seriously enough. You're paying it off until you're like 50. It sounds very stressful yeah. to be a part of. It is. I hate having loans. I mean, they're helpful, but like having to pay it back, it's just stressful. It's a lot to think about and a lot to worry about for the future, especially not knowing what I want to do yet. In the future, you'll look at like maybe refinancing to get lower interest rates. Definitely. I think, yeah, for sure. Anything helps, really. Yeah, probably. Yeah, 100%. <laughs> I wish I could, but yeah. I don't know how. <laughs> if you're interested in learning more on how YRefi is diverting the debt crisis, head over to YRefi.com. And if you're interested in investing and being a part of the solution, head over to investyrefi.com.